Mike Knox and Meek Mill are on the internet telling each other to pull up. Both of them saying they in Philly at the same time. And I don't know what's going on with this situation, but I got the story for you guys. If you don't know who Mike Knox is, Mike Knox is one of 50 Cent's homeboys, one of 50 Cent's goons, as people be calling it. You know, he did a lot of time in the feds. He formerly was a rapper. I think he's just an entrepreneur now, but I know he's still running around with 50. Um, you know, and him and Meek Mill must have had a conversation because Mike Knox said the conversation didn't really go that well. And he wants Meek to pull up so they could squash the issue or do whatever they got to do. I guess it was a disrespectful conversation. So I got it right here for you guys. This is what Mike Knox posted on Instagram. He tagged Meek Mill. He said, we always been cool and I always showed you nothing but love and support. But today that stops. What you said on that phone to me yesterday, you're going to have to say that to my face. Don't stand behind your niggas and talk crazy because I don't need niggas behind me to stand on anything I say. Me and you can meet up anywhere, cut the block off, and figure this ish out today. I am in Philly all day. All I ever did was talk good about you on interviews and saluted you. I even stood up for you when everybody uh, was talking crazy. I even told 50 Cent, and he tagged 50, and said, you was my man, and I even backed up off the nigga gunplay when you called me and asked me to. Because if you don't know G-Unit, you know, um, and the G-Unit guys around 50 had an issue with gunplay. We all seen the video of gunplay getting jumped and all that by G-Unit back in the day. So Mike Knox said he backed up off gunplay because Meek Mill and him have a relationship. Uh, he said, I never asked you for a dime or a favor. I don't know what's up with you, but we got to figure this out. And you know I am not no B. Uh, I'm moving around in Philly all day. Drop the location. So Meek Mill responded to this right in the comments. You know what I mean? Meek Mill said... Um, talk face, let's talk face to face. I'm in Philly now. I called you 10 times. Let's meet today. So obviously Meek don't have a problem pulling up on Mike Knox and saying what he said on the phone, whatever that issue is about, bro. We don't know, but we know that, uh, Mike Knox is a real dude. I know he did a lot of time in the feds. I know he really about that. And I hope that they get this squash. Um, it might seem to people that ain't from the streets that they really like angry with each other, but it's probably just an aggressive conversation. If you're from it, you know, sometimes, men we get too aggressive with each other. And it's just like, nah, we need to pull up face to face. And you need to talk to me in my face because over the phone, it can get kind of crazy. So I don't think nothing going to come of this. Um, it don't, from what I'm reading, at least, it don't sound like nothing going to come of this. That's too crazy. I think they're going to pull up, have a conversation. Hey, bro, as a man, don't talk to me like that. Hey, bro, as a man, I felt like this. And I think this and I think that. And it'll probably be squashed. But I know that, um, you know, Mike Knox is a real dude. I think Meek is a real dude, too. So I think they're going to squash this, have a conversation, and it'll be over with. they both from Philly, so I don't see it keep going. I don't see it uh, going being what this is right here, that back and forth, keep going back and forth and all that on the Internet. It ain't going to be that. That's how I feel about it. Urban Legend 11, you know what it is. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, bro. I'll see you all next time. I'm out of here.